Hi guys and welcome to another daily vlog. I feel like I start every single vlog in my bedroom. It's because I charge my camera in here overnight so every time I pick up the camera it's always in here and also the lighting in here is good so that's why I always start off in here and it's usually the tidiest room in the house, usually. The rest of the house is very questionable. So today I am heading over to my studio, office, beauty room. I don't even know what to call it. I need to have a name for it so that I can say where I'm going and everybody like on YouTube and also at home knows what I mean. So I think I'm just gonna call it my studio, I think. Even though a studio sounds like I'm an artist or something, but I, I just, I don't know what to call it. Anyway, I'm heading to office slash studio slash beauty room um, today. I did go the other day, like in the evening um, with my mum and we did set up a few little things in there. So it's looking like actually quite put together. So when I show you today, it should be quite a nice update. I've put my couch up in there, which I do like the beauty treatments on. Um, I wanted to kind of just put it up just to make sure I did have enough room to like walk around it and everything. So I've put that up today, I put blankets on it and stuff. So it is actually like coming together. We still need to take a few things tonight. I've got like a shelving unit that I want to put up. Um, so me and Ollie can do that later tonight. But today I'm actually going to head there and I'm going to put a few things in and move things around a bit. I'm going to have a coffee. And then I'm actually going to log on to my student like website thing, the Open University website. Because even though technically I haven't actually started yet, I start on the 5th of February and today is the 31st of January. So not long at all. But I actually don't know if there's stuff that I should have done before. I'm just really not sure. Like I've had lots of emails, but they're more about joining calls and fresher stuff and like chatting with other students which I don't have the confidence to do that yet. I'm quite shy actually and um, I yeah I would get really nervous to be like chatting with other students straight away so I haven't actually done that but I might go on and like send an email to my tutor saying hello and stuff and just figure out if there's anything that I should have done in preparation um, and see if I can open up some modules or something and have a look and start like researching stuff because I would like to be ahead of my game a little bit. I always like to be a little bit ahead instead of a little bit behind. So if I can start now, I will start now. So yeah, I'm going to head there, see if I can get some stuff done, show you around a bit more and yeah, spend the day with you. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. very strange but the studio is looking a little bit better I'm just going to tidy up a bit and then I'm going to show you what it's looking like ready to show you a little bit of a tour of my current setup. Um, bear in mind a few bits that I haven't finished yet so I do have more bits to do but I'm feeling so good about this space and I just, when I'm here I feel, I don't know, really inspired and ready to get on with things. So I think that's amazing because that is what I really hoped I would get from having this separate space. So um, let me show you. Okay, so this is the current setup for the couch. Um, and I'm so happy, I think it looks really cozy. Obviously it's quite bright in here at the moment because um, it's daytime. Sorry if I'm talking so quiet, but there's like people around and I don't want to sound strange. So um, this is the couch, obviously for massages. This is a throw that I got from b and it's really nice. Uh, then we've got the cabinet there, as we can see the door just will not close properly. Little coffee machine set up. I am going to be hiding all these cables because I do have another extension need 
that will cover up all of those, that'll be good. Then from this angle you can really see like my desk and workspace set up, so that's the end of the cabinet with the coffee machine on it. Then I have this little chair and stool over here which is going to be used for pedicures but also for me to have little breaks on and stuff in between studying. Um, this is my little side table from Home Bargains with the vase on it and then I've just got, this is like a local magazine that we have on the Isle of Wight. Um, some pampas in there so I think this area is looking really cosy again all these wires will be like hidden and then this is my desk I bought this little cabinet in today it's quite old but um I think it fits under there all right uh, I've got this chair here and then yeah this is my setup for today these are my study books I've got my laptop iPad as well and um, some more books here my glasses I lit my candle the clock needs a battery one thing I need is a battery and a teaspoon. Um, and then I've got a few bits here, this very annoying <laughs> red, which I was gonna put this in here, but it doesn't even fit in there. And I'm like, this bloody red thing. Anyway, it's bothering me, but in a minute, I'm gonna have a whole shelving rack up here with baskets and stuff on it. So I'll be able to hide away things in there. So that space there will be filled. Radiator cover coming to cover this, which obviously have shelves on it. And then I'm gonna put like a mirror and stuff on this wall, because this wall looks very plain. This is just all my junk down here. My sister-in-law is an artist who uses the room next door. So she's actually gonna put some paintings up in here for me to fill the walls, which will look absolutely amazing. Very excited for that. So right now I'm gonna sit down here, I'm gonna drink my coffee and I'm going to do a little bit of studying or figuring out what the hell I'm supposed to do. I'm now back in the car and I'm just sat outside my house. I've gone home. Um, I spent a few hours like studying there because the module had actually like opened. I was able to kind of start it um, even though I haven't officially started the course yet. So I hope that that wasn't wrong that I did that, but I thought I've got some time. I might as well sit down and kind of see what it feels like to be studying again. Um, so I really, really enjoyed it. I loved it so much. It's just so cozy in there and like had the little coffee machines. I was having coffees and teas and just like a lot of it's like watching videos and like answering questions on videos and stuff. Um, so I think basically for the first, um, I guess it's like six seven months um i'm going to be studying social sciences which is all part of my forensic psychology degree but obviously you don't go straight into a degree and start studying all of that nitty gritty stuff straight away you have to like build it up and learn lots of different modules which other people would learn in other courses as well so i think what i'm learning at the minute is what people would learn in a any psychology course as like the months or years or however long i don't know when but as it goes along i will then start learning more dedicated stuff on the course that I'm studying um so yeah social sciences is what I'm studying until October so it's a lot of like looking at different social situations um the studying that I did today was basically um looking at this street and it's a street in Cardiff and how the differences between the people that live there like um how people end up in the situations that they're in the businesses whether they're surviving or not surviving so all kind of like social stuff within that street so that was really interesting actually I um, mean that's obviously only the start of it so um obviously as I'm vlogging throughout this whole experience I'm not going to like tell you every single little thing I'm studying because you know you I think you might as well just study the course if you want to know every single thing um but I'll kind of just give you the gist of what it's like studying um how it works if you want a full video on how I applied how much it costs how you set it up how you start obviously I'm not quite sure on that at the minute maybe give me a few weeks just to get into it um just let me know and I can do a whole video on what it's like starting this and also what it's like studying and working together and how I'm gonna like schedule it all and plan it all because I am going to be very strict like I am going to have set hours that I work and study so if you want to know all of that then just leave me a comment 
Uh, so for now I am just going in the house for a bit. I'm going to wait for Ollie to finish work and then we're going to head back out, put some put a few more bits in and that will probably be it for today and then I think the next video after this one will be a full studio tour um which yeah that's quite exciting to do so I'm looking forward to do that one um but I shall probably see you a little bit later when we're putting some more furniture together and whatever so I'll see you later good old Ollie bringing up my um shelving unit <laughs> is it heavy <laughs> don't don't joke <laughs> the shelf just fell out. Show them how the shelf fell out. <laughs> we were like, oh my god, the shelf's falling out. Why is it like that? Can't put anything on it. Then realised Ollie's put it in upside down, basically. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so it, actually, uh... <laughs> it needs to go the other way up. <laughs> Otherwise, them shelves are going to be useless. <laughs> Don't put much weight on them. No. Okay, so it's all in. I've added these two little baskets on there and then up here, ignore that, I'm gonna have like decor on this bit and then I'm gonna have two big boxes down here that I can store stuff in. Um, and then we have just moved the desk along a bit just to create this kind of like desk area here. And then this lounging area seems a little bit bigger space now. Um, so yeah, really happy with how it's looking. Obviously it's very dark outside now. Um, and then everything else is pretty much the same. Just waiting for my radiator cover to go here. I've got quite a big one, so I've got like a nice shelf all the way along and then I can put mirrors and stuff on it there. Um, yeah, so it's all coming along very nicely. And it's just so cozy in here. Like, look how cozy that looks. I've got rid of the wires here as well. I still need to sort out some like plugs and stuff to go underneath there um but yeah so there's a lot less wires hanging around which is nice so i think that's pretty much all of the updates that i've got for today so i've had a really really good day today and i'm really happy with how it's coming along so um i'll see you in the next vlog I'm not sure when that's going to be but any updates and i will vlog it so i'll see you in the next video bye